We now turn to Herald Tribune ticket editor Wade Tatangelo for a look at the Crescent Club in this week's Bar Tab. I take my first step inside the Crescent Club and the sunny afternoon closes behind me. I'm surrounded by shadows and cigarette smoke and nicotine stained everything and sports flickering on TVs and signs that say stuff like hands off the barmaid. The counter is half full of regulars, all calling to each other and the bartenders by name. I spot an old Newport cigarette machine, the kind with the pool knobs in the corner. The guy to my right clutches a bottle of Budweiser, and I order the same. He says his goodbyes, and now I'm talking to the guys to my left. One is drinking a bottle of Coors Light, while his pal is an Amstel Light. I'm hoping they were regal me with tales of smuggling square grouper into Florida during their wild days in the 1970s. And maybe they did, but they're not telling. It's like the leathery guys at Jimmy Buffett shows, the guys who most likely made their money as doctors or lawyers, but just maybe by hook or by crook. The fellow with the amp still orders a shot at Jack Daniels Tennessee Fire, explaining that it is like the fireball cinnamon whiskey popular with the kids these days, but better because it's made by the good people from Jack Daniels. Soon, the three of us are all sipping and praising the merits of Jack Daniels Fire. The bartenders are joking with us, and within less than an hour, I feel as welcome as the rest of the regulars. I want to stay, but I'm a long way from home. And so I take a stroll on the beach before returning to my car and listening to Jimmy Buffett recite God's Own Drunk. The Crescent Club, which opened in 1949, is at 6519 Midnight Pass Road on Siesta Key. I'm Wade Tatanzo of the Herald Tribune. To read more about the Crescent Club, the greatest dive bar in the area, the greatest dive bar maybe in the whole state, go to TicketSarasota.com.